Hello once again, Brother Teacher here. I feel it necessary to set the record straight concerning a subject. The subject is uh, about Bruce Lee, the martial artist, the legendary martial arts practitioner and movie personage. And more specifically, someone uh, made a statement by way of messaging me on my platform concerning a Bruce Lee subject and the statement that they made more directly was related to the amount of views I get on Bruce Lee subject matter versus the other things that I do on YouTube. Now I want you to understand something, comprehend something and if that individual is watching you need to listen as well if you are intelligent enough to listen and to use critical thinking. It may be true that you see a lot of response, replies, comments concerning the Bruce Lee subject matter that I usually post on this particular channel. But there's a reason behind that if you see it in a significant amount that is. And I told this person in my response that I have almost 2,000 videos on this platform and the Bruce Lee subjects are not even a good one-third of those maybe one-fourth be it as it may the reason that my Bruce Lee uh, videos get the amount of tension that they do not just simply because it's about Bruce Lee but because they are not a threat I'll let you pause for a moment as I have to think about it they are not a threat to the powers that be the powers that govern and control this particular platform and the corporations behind the scenes now what do I mean I mean this. When I first started this channel, I skyrocketed within two years in terms of followers. And that diminished almost instantaneously around that two year mark. But why, you might ask, is it the wordage that I use? keywords, keyword phrases, not in and of itself that has something to do with it, but it's the subject matter that I use. See, a lot of people didn't know what they were getting when they met me here on this channel. They didn't think that I was anything other than a martial artist, master, grandmaster, instructor, until a couple years into it. Many people found out and realized out here on the net, worldwide net, that I'm an activist. Always have been. I'm a consciously devoted man to the freedom of individuality, independence in the world. Always have been. When the people that control things to include where you see me at right now when they realize that I'm controversial especially when it concerns things that could potentially affect various industries and or corporations they limited the amount of traffic that comes to my channel they did they limited the amount of responses from my potential followers you know why where there's numbers there's strength right and the reason again that the Bruce Lee and martial arts videos got so much response and reply again it doesn't affect them in a negative way but when I begin to talk about the rights of the people when I begin to talk about 
poison and chemicals and things of this nature in our food and water supply. When I begin to talk about the ravages of humanity and how we are not equal as a people on this planet, we're not a brotherhood on this planet. We've all been stepped on and we all have been treated as pawns as such, even in this country, America. Anytime you try to elevate the consciousness of your fellow man, the people who are controlling the world, who you never see, they come and see about you. They will do any and everything possible to keep you quiet, even if it means taking away your freedom of speech by censoring you. I am one of those examples. I'm not as big as David Icke and some of the other personalities, but they know that I would be there, pretty close to there by now, had they not did what they did. So I just wanted to give some clarity and be transparent to you as to why you see other subjects that seem to be friendly or friendlier receive more response from an audience than do my videos on self-awareness and freedom. That's the reason. Because they really don't want us to be free. They want us to be slaves to the system. Continual slaves. They don't want us to have our own independence and freedom of speech unless we're saying what they want us to say. That was really it. So to the individual that made the statement that you always get more views and you're posting these things about Bruce Lee because you want to get your numbers up on this particular platform, that is so far from the truth. I talk about virtually everything. And if you follow me for any length of time, you will know that to be true. I talk about virtually everything, especially those things that help you to be a better you. Health, spirituality, if you will, and your awareness of the world in which you live in, government and otherwise. I talk about it all. And a lot of times I leave some gems for you to really pause and consider. Sometimes I'm not as deep and hard as I really want to be because I don't know if my video, my videos will be removed again. I did have one several months ago. As long as I have been on this platform, I've never had a video removed until then. You know why? It was a controversial subject. It was one that they didn't want the general populace to see. So they removed it. And they told me, that it was because I didn't follow the guidelines. I was insulted. I wasn't angry. I really knew that it was a matter of time before they started flagging the things that I put here on this platform. So I want you to have a heads up. I want you to be aware that we are being censored. We are being watched, surveilled. We always have been. It's just simply escalated. So keep this in mind and understand this, comprehend this. I will never change. I still love you. The Almighty still loves you. But I will say this to you every opportunity that you get, copy my videos and people like me. Store it away, archive it watch it often because the videos like this are those things that can help give you some sense of reason some sense of comfort even because the world is not the world that we all grew up in or seemingly it has become worse and it's not going to get better we must be better and the only way that we can be better is to arm ourselves with knowledge 
in education about the world that we truly live in and not the one that they try to paint and make us believe that we're in. That was it. And that was all. Keep this in mind. Brother Teacher, out.